Good morning, everyone. This is Matt Tour with Insurance Agency Marketing Services. Glad you could join us this morning. We're going to be going over some IRA updates on some of the annuities we're offering that fit really well into that marketplace. We'll be going over some of the uh, current maximum deposits based on different uh, situations on clients' incomes. We're going to be going over some of the Roth IRA versus traditional IRA differences. Talking a little bit about some gift opportunities, the maximum you can put into a, a gift situation, and some other tidbits of information on this year's tax facts details. We do have a three-page tax facts booklet we can go ahead and, and send over to you at your request. We can go ahead and email that to you if you'd like to take a, a look at the uh, the current 2017 numbers. Be glad to get that done. And we are continuing to offer our new producer bonus. You can earn different incentives based on production. So if that's something you have interest in partaking, definitely uh, get on board and start writing business with IMS. You can get yourself some nice coaching programs. We've got a Ritz-Carlton weekend getaway. We have an iPad. We have different cash incentives. Really a lot of different opportunities for you to advance yourself in the first few months with IMS and a great way to get some additional incentives based on your production. So we have a $100,000 level, a $300,000 level, and a half a million dollar level. It's kind of your choice on which way you want to go based on those levels. So definitely take advantage of those opportunities. We just announced our next incentive trip is to the number one resort in Arizona. It's the Boulders. It's a very nice uh Location there in Scottsdale, beautiful tennis opportunities. They've got golf, a couple different golf courses, really nice. The uh, trip itself is going to be in 2018, February the 25th and 28th. You do have through the end of this year to qualify. Qualification did start the beginning of July of 2016. We've already had... 15 qualifiers qualify for the trip, so really a, a nice uh, nice combination there. Anything you may need on the trip, qualification points, definitely give us a call. We'll give you your updated point totals. Again, you do have to the end of December to qualify for the Boulder. Should be a, a really nice location there in Scottsdale. So look forward to having you on board at our, our next trip. We do continue to offer the creative services for you in the, in the field. We have different uh, opportunities for you to get on with our website development team. You can do radio advertising. We have a lot of really good branding opportunities. Maybe you want to redo your letterhead, do, redo your, your business logo. We have a, a really good department that takes care of that. They take care of your needs for postcards pens, pencils, anything you want to put your, your name on, we can go ahead and, and hook you up with the right business to create those logos for you and to go ahead and get that uh, redefined for you out there in the field. And if you do uh, a decent amount of business where you want to take a look at the radio advertising or the TV advertising, we can go ahead and, and get that done for you at the same time. And it should be a really good opportunity for you to get out and rebrand your, your business, rebrand yourself and to create some, some new sense of urgency there in the field based on your, your new ideas. We also are coming up with our, our next Life and Annuity Academy. I know we, we do these about uh, three times a year. And if it's something you have some interest in, I'm going to launch a quick poll here. We're, we're doing another academy coming up in May. It's May the 17th or the 19th. We offer a lot of very valuable information you can pick up on sales ideas for both life insurance and annuities. We're bringing a number of really high-end speakers, bringing some of our top producers to go over some sales ideas, some closing ideas, a lot of information you can take advantage of there. It is a two-day training. We typically fly you in like on a Wednesday afternoon. The training starts Wednesday evening and goes all day Thursday. It goes till about noon on Friday and then you would fly back or drive back to your location. We typically take care of all of your expenses. We take care of your travel, your lodging, your food expenses. Everything is taken care of for you. 
and plus you pick up some very valuable sales ideas. So really good time way to spend a, a couple days out of the market and come and come to one of our meetings. We also have some very valuable software information we'll be discussing at these. And we do typically bring in about 40 agents to each one of these meetings. So really it's a good opportunity for you to pick up some different ideas from different agents from, from throughout the country. You can pick up some different closing ideas for sales and really a valuable way to spend a, a couple of days out of the, out of the field. So some you have some interest in, go ahead and, and mark down. Yes, you would have interest in attending one of our, our meetings. As I mentioned, our first one's coming up in May. Our next one probably won't be until August. And it's really a great way for you to learn some of the current trends with the DOL rulings. We're going to have updates on that end. I know that uh, a lot of people are talking about that DOL being delayed for six months. We'll see what the final situation is with that. And we should hopefully know that in the next couple of weeks. If you do have any questions on the DOL, you can always give us a call. We'll go ahead and give you the <coughs> most up-to-date information we have through IMES and hopefully be able to get those questions answered for you based on those requirements. But once again, if you do have interest in coming out to our next meeting, go ahead and mark yes on this <coughs> question on the screen right now. It's going to be in Des Moines, Iowa at the Athena Home Office. We do have to have you contacted with Athena in order to attend. And we do, we'd like to have you submitted some business before you do attend the meeting. So you can go ahead and get your contracts in, get licensed up with Athena and submit some production. <coughs> That's a great way for you to get uh, get involved and get in, invited to this meeting. So definitely keep that in mind. I'm gonna go ahead and close up this poll right now. And get moved on here. We have just recently <coughs> opened up a, our wealth management team, which we deal on the RIA side of the market. And I know we also have Carlton and Associates is, is a BD option for you. So if you're looking at getting involved in the security side of the market, getting your Series 65 passed, or if you currently have a Series 6 or 7 or 63, go ahead and give Charles hiring junior a call in our office he'll go go ahead and go over some of the things we're offering through our groups i know we have uh, very powerful payouts on the indexed annuity side of the market very high payout percentages on those we also have very good payouts on the security side so if you are currently in a relationship or you're not happy with your current payouts or you're looking for a change Charles would be a, a great individual to talk to in the office, and he'd be glad to lead you in the right direction. So definitely take take advantage of the wealth management side of the uh, the IMS business here. You got some great ways for your your clients to get involved with both the insurance and the security side of the market at the same time, and you would be able to handle both ends of that based on your relationship with those clients. So. Definitely keep that in mind. If that's something you have some interest in, uh, you want to give Charles Hiring Jr. a call to get that taken care of. We also are, are very competitive in the single premium life side of the market right now. We've got a, a number of different single premium life companies that have these programs available for your clients. And it's a great way for you to earn some additional commissions. You've got a lot less on suitability requirements. They do have the return to premium option. You got some bonuses available on some of these single premium life programs. Of course, they also have the advanced benefits with accelerated benefits for long-term care, terminal illness, home health care. So <laughs> a lot of opportunities for your clients to have multiple asset situations where they can have coverage for long-term care they can have the life side of it and I mean we also have annuity combinations they can get involved in so kind of make two or three sales at one time so we're a great way for your clients to take advantage of the some of the new programs that are available in the marketplace right now with some of these accelerated benefits I know there's a lot less companies 
involved in the straight long-term care market. We've seen a number of carriers get out of that market space the last couple of years with the costs increasing on the claim side, the number of sales dropping on the, on the long-term care side. A lot of companies are looking for different ways to wrap those benefits on some of the life policies and annuity programs available in the market right now. So I think you're going to continue to see those develop on that side and a great way for your clients to get multiple coverages at one time and not be in a sense of I'm throwing money down the drain by paying for these long-term care premiums. So definitely keep those in mind. I know that uh, right now it is not rabbit season. I do believe we're looking at IRA season. So right now is a great time to get involved in IRA sales. We have a, a lot of individuals out there right now that are currently getting their taxes done. They're looking at, at different deduction opportunities to save money on their taxes, pay a little bit less to Uncle Sam. And it's a great way for you to get a client on board. You know, It may not be a huge sale to start with, but if you can get clients on board, they're doing their IRA contributions with you every year. They're putting in $5,500. They're putting in $6,500 a year. I mean, those numbers do grow. If they end up changing jobs, they, you have the opportunity of moving some of their 401k money or some of their retirement funds to some different programs. I mean, the number one thing you can do on your end is get more clients in your book of business. And by having more clients, you're going to make more money down the road and have bigger and better opportunities there in the upcoming years. I know currently your, your IRA contributions for 16 and 17 stand at $5,500 for ages 0 to 49. You have a $6,500 maximum deposit, 50 and above. There are, of course, limitations on the types of income that you can have in a family as a, as a single or a married filing jointly. If you're looking at some different opportunities, you're, you're looking at a Roth IRA versus a, an IRA traditional, you have much higher limits on the Roth side. So make sure you are aware if your client may not be able to put money in for the traditional IRA, they may be able to put money into a Roth IRA based on their limitations on the income programs that they are currently involved in. As I mentioned, Roth IRAs have much higher income limits. If you take a look at the a single individual, the phase out period for a Roth IRA is between 118,000 and 133,000. If you look at a traditional IRA, the phase out period is between 62,000 and 72,000. So much lower phase out numbers on the traditional IRAs as opposed to a Roth. So definitely keep that in mind. If your clients are looking at some different uh, higher deposit options, if you're looking at um, individuals that, that own businesses, you can look at simple IRAs, which you can put in uh, about $12,500, 49 years of age and below. You can put put in an additional $3,000, uh, age 15 above, on the simple catch-up situation. So you can put a total of 15.5 in, and you can also look at SEPs. Uh, self-employed pension and that right now has a maximum of $54,000 you can put into a SEP based on your clients. So you do have some great options there to, to, for your clients to put in additional dollars up and above the traditional IRA side. So with us bringing on the wealth management side, we do have a lot of really good opportunities there on some of the, the non-traditional qualified products your clients can get involved in. So definitely keep that keep that handy. When you take a look at some of the companies we offer that do allow lower deposits to go into their their annuities, especially on the qualified side of the market, we're going to take a quick look at Athene. We're going to do a quick look at Equitrust, Life of the Southwest, National Western Life, North American, and we'll also look at a, a really good plan through Sagicor. We'll do some, some real brief summaries on some of these programs and kind of what they're offering in the field and some of the minimum deposit requirements that they do have and some of your options there on the, on the programs themselves.
If you take a look at Athene right now, they've recently introduced their new accumulator series. It's an indexed series. You have a five-year, a seven-year, and a 10-year option. They do have a minimum deposit of $5,000, so that's a much lower deposit number than a lot, typically a lot of carriers have out there right now. A lot of different uh, index strategies your clients can choose from on these. You've got your S&P index. You have a BNP Paribus index to choose from. There's also a Morningstar index, which is a, a bond fund. Really a, a lot of different choices for your clients to choose from in that new accumulator series. As I mentioned, you have a five-year, a seven-year, and a 10-year. The longer you go out, the higher the caps are going to be. Let's give you a quick example. If you have you know, a $5,000 deposit going in, and your client wants to look at a five-year, the current S&P annual point-to-point -point cap is at four and a, three quarters, so 4.75 on that. But if you go up to 10 years, your cap is at five and a quarter. So you get an additional half a percent on the cap by taking on that little bit longer program. And if you have someone that's in their 40s or 30s that's looking at you know going longer term, that tenure shouldn't really be a problem for them. It should be a good option for them to take advantage of those lower deposit numbers and be able to get involved with, a, with the index, of course, with no risk. Great opportunities on that side. I've also recently introduced their their new max rate series, which is their multi-year rate guarantee annuity series. They have a three-year, a five-year, and a seven-year to choose from. Depending on the state, there's an MVA version, and there's also a non-MVA version on those contracts. They also require $5,000 to go in. The uh, three-year contract is, uh, of course, a very short-term MYG contract. Your rates are in the mid one and a half to one three quarters range, and that is a flexible premium policy. So your clients can put additional deposits in that, this down the way, and that way they can lock, lock in some pretty decent fixed interest rates there. Athena also offers their Benefit 10, which is really a, a nice combination product. Really good for someone that's approaching uh, retirement and a, a very good plan to use for RMDs. I know they've got a really good dollar with for dollar withdrawal option on that benefit 10 i know we have a lot of agents using that for your their clients that are approaching that seven and a half range where they seem to start taking out deposits of dollars and that's going to be matched dollar for dollar on, on that end so do keep that in mind if you got someone that's a little bit older that's looking at taking advantage of those those opportunities equitrust uh, has a couple different plans available that uh, do meet the the qualified standards. Their market booster goes down to $2,000 on initial qualified investment. Uh, good thing about this plan, it has a 7% bonus rate. You do earn that over a three year period. You're in 4% day one, you're in 2% in the second year, and 1% in the third year in the bonus. So you get a total of 7%. Current cap on that is 3.5% on the annual point to point strategy. It is a nine year contract, so a little bit shorter in duration than some of the other longer term programs. And again, the good thing about that market booster, it only requires $2,000 to get into it. Really a, a small amount of money if you wanna go with a little bit of a deposit. It is a flexible premium policy as you can put additional deposits in anytime you want. And then uh, of course, anything you put in the first year is gonna earn that 4% bonus on it. So really a nice program to go with. The Certainty Select Series is their multi-year rate guarantee option. There is a $10,000 minimum deposit. Of course, if you combine two years, maybe you wanna do 2016 and 2017 traditional IRA deposits. If you're under 50, you can put in uh, 13,000, actually $11,000 based on the 5,500 per year. And if you're 50 or above, you can actually put in 13 grand, which is $6,500 a year which should meet that $10,000 requirement. Life of the Southwest is really the, the only carrier we have that you can go down to a $100 initial deposit on. They've got a couple different policies you can do that on. They're Secure Plus Paramount 5, which has a 5% bonus on any deposits the first five years. You can also go through Secure Plus Platinum, 
You can put in as little as $100 a month. You do have to set these up on bank deposits, so you'd have to set it on a bank withdrawal, and they would go down to $800 a month. So very low minimum requirements with Life of the Southwest. If you do have any questions along the way, you can go ahead and get those asked. We'll be glad to get that taken care of for you. Anyway, a little misspelling there on the certainty. Not sure why that got changed there, but uh, we'll get that changed for the next presentation. National Western Life is another good option to go with on the IRA side of the market. National Western Life does have a commission bonus going right now. You can earn 11% commission at this point on their Ultra Classic annuity. It's a flexible premium indexed annuity. Goes down to $2,000 of qualified deposit. It does not have a bonus, but it does have the 11% commission right now. If you would like to go with the bonus option, you can go with the Ultra Future. That does have a 9% bonus on it. It currently has a 6% commission. So really a, a nice combination right there on that contract. And then we also have the Protector 1, which is a straight fixed rate annuity. And that's another option you can use with National Western Life. So you do have three different possibilities. I know we do sell a lot of the Ultra Future with National Western Life that does have that 9% bonus rate. It's a flexible premium policy. <laughs> You're in that 9% of anything deposit the first year. If your client puts additional deposits years two through five in, your client would earn four and three quarters bonus based on those additional deposits those next few years. Again, this is paying an additional 1% commission right now, so commission is up to 6%. Uh, great combination. National Western Life is an A-rated carrier. They've been around for a while. They're very active in the annuity market space, so really a good option to go with on that side. North American is another good carrier to look at. They are a plus rated company. They have their performance choice 8 and 12 contracts. Those do go down to $2,000 of qualified deposit. And you have a, a, a huge number of indexes to choose from with these two contracts on the performance choice series. They have the NASDAQ, the Russell 2000, the Euro Stocks Index. They've got the Hang Seng. They have a Dow Jones. They have an S&P Midcap. I mean, this performance choice index has the most choices of any of our companies in regards to the index choices. And it's a, it's a great opportunity for your client to diversify their funds. Maybe they want to have some of their money in some European stocks. Maybe they want to have some in domestic stocks. They have a choice with the performance choice 8 or 12, depending on the duration you want to go with. Really a, a strong combination there. They also offer a multi-year rate guarantee plan called the Guarantee Choice. The Guarantee Choice has guarantee periods right now anywhere between 3 and 10 years. They do require $2,000 to get into that policy on qualified monies. And, of course, the shorter period of time you go, the lower the interest rate is going to be and the lower the compensation is going to be. If you go out longer, you're looking at higher interest rates and higher compensation. National Western Life, I did have a question come up regarding the durations of the products and the minimums that to put in. Again, the Minimum deposit with National Western Life on their Ultra Classic and Ultra Future is $2,000. And then the Protector 1, I believe, is $10,000 initial deposit to put to start up with the Protector 1. And then the Ultra Future is a 15-year contract. The Ultra Classic is a 13-year and I believe the Protector 1 is a 10-year contract. So you have, do, do have different options for durations there. National Western Life, of course, does pay higher compensation. There's no one else out there paying an 11% commission on an annuity right now. Really a, a strong combination. 
the last company we're going to talk about is Sagicor. Sagicor is a, a really strong company, and they've got their, their Sage Select annuity. It's been uh, very popular in the market space here lately. Good thing about the Sage Select right now, it's got some really good guaranteed rates. You've got a 4% annual point-to-point -point cap. You've got a 4% bonus. You have a fixed account paying 2%. And then you have a global strategy with a 20% participation right now. This plan does require $2,000 to get in. It's a 10-year contract, and the compensation is 4.5%. So really a great combination across the board. They're worth Sagicor. Again, they do go down to $2,000 on qualified or non-qualified money. So if you do have a client that doesn't have a lot to invest, maybe they're younger, they want to get started now. You know, be able to put in $2,000 on a non-qualified situation is very difficult to find these days. And that Sagicor plan is one of the very few out there that does still offer that. Those are the, the main cares we're offering right now that do offer the IRA opportunities based on, you know, the deposit amounts they offer available to clients. We have that one company, Life of the Southwest, that does go down to hundred dollars to put in based on their your clients needs again if you would like our 2017 tax facts sheets uh, the third page is really a good page it gives you the inherited IRA table along with the uniform lifetime table so you can use it to figure out your RMDs for inherited money or non-inherited money Really a nice package to look at. I get a lot of calls throughout the week where people are asking, what, what, what's a 43-year-old have to take out for RMDs? And, and these tables are very difficult to come by. I mean, I've searched on the Internet. Uh, usually can find it, but sometimes it does take me a while to locate that table. But if you make a request today, we'll go ahead and send you this this tax facts information over to you. It gives you the the different levels of income based on the different tax rates. I mean, you're looking at, you know, the 25% tax rate table, the 28% tax rate table. You've got the uh, annual gift amount you could do right now is $14,000. Your estate tax unified credit is 5.4 million. So, I mean, it gives you a lot of good information on these pages. It gives you the under earned income Medicare contribution tax. You got the health savings account, maximums, minimums on that side. You got your capital gains and dividend tax rates. Of course, you've got your qualified plan contribution limits. You got, you got your 401ks, your catch-up contributions, your simple IRA contributions, your SEP participation limits. So really a, a nice packet of information you can get from us. So that's something you want go ahead and, and shoot me a uh, email we'll be glad to get that over to you I mean I'll be following up with everyone uh, after the seminar itself and we'll go ahead and get these uh, these tax forms emailed to you we'll go ahead and uh, just flat out email it to everyone that did attend the meeting today and then we will have to take a look and see what plans are available in New York there Joe I'll have to take a look at the, the product approval list. I know New York is a very difficult state to get plans in. We have very few indexed annuities available in New York, but we do have a few of the straight fixed rate. We'll have to take a look and see what's available out there in the state of New York. Once again, I do I appreciate everybody's interest today. We do like to keep these down to a half an hour in length. That way we can get back to business. Anything you've got questions on, my name is Matt. Toll free number 800-255-5055. Everyone have a great week. Hopefully we can help you out with some of your IRA clients. And hopefully you guys have a great tax season and have a great start to 2017. Bye now.